guys today we're gonna to be making pumpkin soup join me in my kitchen these are the ingredients that i'm going to be using to cook the pumpkin soup and this is the pumpkin as you can see now we drop our pan in the fire and drop some a little oil inside then we're going to be adding onions and garlic and ginger together and we're going to be putting them in the pot first now we pick the onions Then we take our wood spoon to turn the onions together and we let it cook of one minute. Then I'm going to be showing you people how to make the beef. We just grind the beef, how to roll it as a ball. We're going to be adding that one inside the soup. That will be the last one we add on the spoon this is the example how to do the raw ball grinding meat then we check our onions to see if it's ready brown as you can see it is cooked and ready to add the rest ingredient on it now we take our celery and leg together we drop it inside the pan Then we also had our another ingredient that is courgette inside the pan. Then we turn it all the way together. As we turn it together to make everything together. Then we let it cook and we take the other ingredient as well now we take the pumpkin inside the pot as well as you can see the pumpkin is a lot we're going to be making a lot of soup today then we take the other the last ingredient that this is the carrot we add it as well then we take our rosemary we're going to be picking our rosemary one one stuck out from the stick we add it inside the pot as well now our rosemary is in the pot we had to take hardy water on it right away Now we're going to be adding our stock on it. Then we'll cover it up and let it cook at least 30 minutes. Then we check it. Oh, look at it. It's, it's cooked and turn it together. Need to turn everything together then after turning it we cover it up again to cook at least 30 minutes again as you can see it is cooked then we turn and cover it up again for 15 minutes now we can check our soup it is ready cooked now we turn it 
you can see everything is cooked and soft then we have to ready to do the next step of grinding the soup first we go to be sharing the soup with other pots we share it before grinding it now we start grinding because we have to share the soup into two because it is too much to grind everything once now we grind everything together it is ready now we had our ball that we just rolled beginning because it's the last to drop inside the soup this is the ball and we turn everything together we take our spoon and roll everything and we let it cook and we cover the pot and so they can cook at the 15 minutes it is ready cook and it's time for eating and this is the result of my soup thanks for watching bye bye next time